space that we're back here, and we've given this some time to so dry out, and it has dried out here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the uh, light up here, and uh, there is a ridge line there, and there's a ridge line here. Um, but this is basically smooth right here. So um, so now what I'm going to do is uh, so I'm going to turn this uh, light off and take out my orange blade right here. Uh, and now what I'm going to do is carve away these, these ridge lines here. So I'm going to start with uh, this one here, and I'm just going to shave it up here. So that is my sanding there, and then there's this one here, and I'm just going to shave that off there. And now we're going to work on putting the mud in this valley here and this valley here. So I'm just going to do a quick shave of this, and then I'm going to grab my, uh, my hawk here. And again, this is just a uh, regular all-purpose joint compound, um, and I have the mud thinned out here. I just added in a little bit of water to the top. And and mixed it with the uh, drill. So we're going to reorganize this here, put it like that, kind of counterclockwise, that puts it to a ball, and we want to extend the ball like that. So to, uh, to uh, load up here, I'm going to turn my knuckles to the uh, back of the trowel here, <coughs> and go upside down, grab it like that, like that, and now we're going to transfer this to the wall right here. So just go up like that. That leaves it like that. I'm going to come back into it here. Go up and down twice. Bring it back over here. And come up with it. Uh, so it's like that. And I'm going to clean this off here. Going clockwise with it. Reorganize it. Now, there was an area. 
area where um, where I came back into the mud and did like a left swipe um, or a counterclockwise swipe with it. Um, and that area is like right here. You can barely see it, but I'm just going to put some mud there. And that's going to take care of that blemish there. Um, so there's a, there was a nail hole here that, or a screw hole here that I forgot. One, one up here. So again, I'm just going to go go around and perhaps fill anything. Um, where I did the corner here, there is an area here where it's kind of like wavy, wavy. So I'm just going to sand it down lightly. And up here, there's a ridge line up here. So I'm going to shake that away here. And then come back, grab some mud there, and fill those in. Um, so there's like a line here. Um, because I, I, I had trouble with the trowel because of this thing here, so I was going to blow it up like that there and put it right there and then go down with it. So that's going to fill in um, that, that, that rough edge there. So it, like, so it uh, basically like fit, feathers out. Um, so like this is kind of rough here, so I'm just going to go down like that. And then this one is here. That's going to take care of that. Uh, I'm going to reorganize the mud here, and all and always keep it to uh, the the, the, um, the um, middle here, so so that it doesn't dry out here. Um, so I'm going to come into it. That's going to load up the middle there. Um, and again, if, if there's not really that rough of a line here, but if there is for for uh, some reason, then just go like this. Okay, and that's going to uh, help fill in that, that rough edge. But this is all still going to need to uh, be sanded there. So um, so it's very important to always just go back and like take a look at, at your work uh, because, again, there will be some scratches or, or concaveness or uh, blemishes. Um, so we're just going to let this dry out, and uh, we'll be back to our sand.